a stern warning from the premier this afternoon that businesses trying to take advantage of consumers during this pandemic by hiking the price of essential products will be punished. If you're selling face masks, protective gloves, cold medicine, hand sanitizer, and disinfecting wipes, and you're hiking the price five times, ten times what it should be, you're done, you're gone. The Premier's cabinet has approved an emergency order that could fine businesses up to $100,000 if they're caught hiking the price of essential goods. Business owners could also face up to a year in jail if caught doing this. Corporations have been given the same warning. If caught, they could face fines up to $10 million, and the company's director could face additional fines as well as potential jail time. Consumers can report price gouging over the phone with Consumer Protection Ontario. Health officials also providing an update on COVID-19 tonight saying the backlog of coronavirus tests are beginning to clear. The lab data, which we can speak about more, uh, is showing that the backlog of numbers is going down. Uh, we were over 10,000, now we're just around 8,500. And so more work to be done, but it's going the right direction. The other aspect is that as we're looking at the hospitalizations, trying to keep the numbers and that we look like currently there's uh, 63 people at this time in ICU um, of 46 in ICU and 17 are not ventilated in those settings there so we continue to see that number uh, slowly coming up. Health officials say they do not have information on how many people have been hospitalized due to COVID-19. The Ford government could be announcing new rules when it comes to social distancing tonight. The Premier is saying this afternoon that he is considering limiting public gatherings from 50 people down to five people. Ford says essential businesses would not be included in this rule.